it's a myriad of environmental insults into the skin. You can think about this as chemical pollutants, toxic chemicals, for example, and accidental exposure. We are all familiar with what melanin is. It's in our skin. It protects our skin. What we just managed to do was make it and harness it into a more optimized version. And so if you like, it's sort of handed to us on a platter. Why would we not go and use it in the skin? Turns out it protects the skin, but it also repairs the skin. And it does this in a variety of ways. It's almost indistinguishable from the natural melanin that's already in people's skin, which clearly is not toxic. With this intervention with the topical melanins, the scalp fell off and the skin is fully healed within a week and there's new skin underneath. There is local protection, but there's also communication with something much deeper, our immune system to really repair the damaged tissue. We've re-imbued the skin with the ability to heal. If such a relatively simple concept can continue to be advanced, if we can impact people's lives with something like that, I mean, that, that's an excellent outcome.